Deseret News Rewind is presented by Tosh, the orthopedic specialty hospital, Utah's premier sports medicine, physical therapy, and sports training center. This is a great combination of size and speed. It's the speed on display here. Jump ball. Makes the ground and a touchdown. I cannot believe what I just saw. Welcome to Freestone Field here at Brighton High School for this edition of High School Rewind. Available on HighSchoolRewind.com, presented by Tosh, the orthopedic specialty hospital. Thank you for joining us, everyone. My name is Dane Stewart. Excited to bring you the region kickoff for both the Brighton Bengals and the Jordan Beat Diggers here on High School Rewind. Let's start by introducing the visiting Jordan Beat Diggers. This is a team that comes in boasting one of the best returning quarterbacks in the entire state in Crew Wakely. And through the first five games, Jordan coming in 4-1 and one overall, and they are a pick six off a fake punt away from being 5-0 and oh coming into this ballgame. But we mentioned Crew Wakely. What a season he has had through those five games. He's already thrown for over 1,000 yards. He's also ran for a few hundred yards. Crew Wakely, talking with Coach Bullitt of Brighton before the game, he said, hey, he was the best player we had to go up against last season. It speaks a lot to the talent of Crew Wakely and what he brings to this Jordan Beat Digger offense. But it's not just Crew you have to worry about. Jake Shaver, watch for this young man, number three out of the backfield, provides a dual rushing, well, really a couple of great runners out of the backfield for the Jordan Beat Diggers. And then on the defensive side, uh, they've got a couple guys who can get after the quarterback as well. The run going to be really key today in stopping that for each side. Jordan going to look to do that against a very good Brighton squad. As we introduce Brighton, 4-1 and one as well coming into this match. As we mentioned, the region kickoff for both. And Brighton coming off a tough loss to the Skyline Eagles. It was a homecoming game here at Brighton High School. Coach Bullitt saying, you know, I, I think homecoming sometimes it's easy to get distracted. He's looking for a renewed effort and focus here today from the home Brighton Bengals. As we introduce a few kids, it all starts with the quarterback, Alex Zettler. And this is a kid that he's got a lot of opportunity. Good dual threat kid, can really get the ball down the field. Good escapability out of the pocket as well. Has some help. Hall, the running back, Davenport on the outside, and defensively watch for Salua Messina, a guy who can really play on the defensive side. It's the Bengals, and it's the Jordan Beat Diggers. The last three meetings between these two teams have all been two-point victories, and it's been an average of 106 total points scored in those three games. We've got a lot of offense on the field tonight here from Freestone Field. The Bengals and the Diggers coming up next here on High School Rewind. From Freestone Field, Region 7 underway for Brighton and Jordan as this kick into the end zone for the touchback. Brighton will start after the touchback on their own 20. They go on the ground. It is a power run scheme. We will see a lot of that tonight as it's Avona Hall with the carry, the junior, ahead for a pickup of six. Second down and four. Zettler is going to keep this. He has this athleticism in his game. He bust one from about this distance last week against Skyline as he takes that up and across the 40. Single back on first down. Screen play, this ball thrown out. Jordan read it well. Boy, the block didn't get there and it was trouble for Devin Elder. The junior receiver made the reception, but tough to get past three digs as he loses a couple yards on the screen. Back to the ground here on second down, Hall. He'll pick up a pair. It'll set up a third down and 11 for Brighton. Trips to the bottom of the screen. Pressure coming, Zettler got rid of it, but it was too tall for his target. Look in the way of Elder, the coverage was solid and Brighton will have to punt on their opening possession. Crew Wakely comes out for his first possession. Starting at the own 23-yard line for the Digs. Brighton bringing pressure. Wakely going to go deep, has a man, and that just through the fingertips. Boy, a beautiful throw looking for Bolingbroke, and he just missed that one. Back in coverage on the play was Wonderly for Brighton. On second down, Wakely keeps a couple of Bengals there. He's able to slip through the initial tackle ahead for a pickup of four yards. Nice play there by Crew Wakely as he was originally contacted right at the line. Third down and six. Edge pressure. Wakely reads it and throws to the empty space. Caught by Kale Wakely, the junior. A nice reception and a first down for Jordan. First down for Crew. He keeps this hole up the middle. Crew Wakely 
A big run for Wakely, still on his feet, down to the 25-yard line. It's a pickup of 35 yards for the Beat Diggers. First and 25, or first and, fit, first and 10 at the 25. This ball thrown on the slant. That is complete to Ben Lisk. Pickup of nine on the play. Wakely thrown underneath. That ball caught by Hennings. Hennings takes a hit, and he takes this ball inside the five for first and goal, Jordan. Shaver to the left of Wakely on first and goal. Wakely keeps it. And stood up, no gain on the play for Crew. Nice job by that big front for Brighton. A couple of Bengals there, including Olive Fafita, the junior. A little slower pace to this Jordan offense here on this first drive. Hand it off, and into the end zone. Touchdown, Jordan! Lamont Roundy from three yards out. The Beat Diggers take a 6-0 lead here with 6.27 left in our opening quarter. Starting on their own 20, give to the fullback. On the carry was Nicholas Parker for Brighton. He's ahead for a pickup of a pair. Another long third down here for Brighton. The throw. That ball caught, but it's going to be shy of the sticks. It was Trey Davenport able to make the reception, but he's two yards short. And Brighton going to have to punt again. After the punt, Jordan from their own 48. Wakely rolling to his right, going to try to dump this one off underneath. And great coverage on the play there by the Brighton Bengals as it falls incomplete. Five-yard penalty there for Jordan. It'll back him up. 4.23 left here opening quarter. The Diggs lead in 7-0. Second and 15, Brighton again showing edge pressure. It gets to Wakely. He dumps it off underneath the bowling broke and at play. Not a lot of room there. Great job making the tackle by Nicholas Parker. Crew. Boy, he wanted to give it to Shaver. And it wasn't looking. Crew's going to have to eat it on the sack. The Brighton defense gets a big stop, and Jordan's going to have to punt. First and 10. Under center, Zettler. Toss play. Looking for a lane, and again, that Jordan defense, tell you what, flying to the ball as they limit the gain from Kipu Fafita. Five receivers on second down. It's a sweet play. Boy, what a hit. Tell you what, Hall was looking to get around, and Hunter Swap just came up. The junior safety laying a big hit on Brighton. Zettler going to keep it. Has the blocking set up. Zettler up the middle, and it's a nice first down by Alex Zettler. First down, back to the ground, and nowhere to go is Manaya Talaga. Just a sophomore. Number six for Jordan comes in and makes the tackle on the sophomore tailback for Brighton, Fafita. On second down, back to the ground, and Fafita keeping the legs churning, has this inside the 35. Third and five, Zettler to Davenport, that ball tipped. Great job getting the mitts on it, as it was Isaiah Fawson, the linebacker, able to tip it incomplete. Smith from 50 yards. Hold is good. It's got the distance, but it curled to the left. And the field goal try is no good. Wide to the left as our first quarter comes to a close. Second down. Wakely throws underneath. Nice one-handed snag by Bolenbroke. Bolenbroke across the field. Now going to... No, it gets through a couple more Bengals as Bolenbroke tackled out of bounds up to the 44. And what a run made after the catch there by Ethan Bolenbroke. Jordan looking to get set up here for the play. First down. Wakely looking to throw on first down. Has men down the field. He's got a man wide open. And that ball is caught by Hughes. Hughes makes another man miss. Touchdown, Jordan! A 55-yard touchdown pass, and what a play from Wakely as he came out of the pocket, and Hughes was left all alone. Brighton lost him as they were worried about Wakely getting outside the pocket. The defense 
Forgot about Hughes and he makes them pay with a big touchdown. First down, I formation, play actions. Zettler rolling to his right, has a man underneath, finds him. That ball caught by Parker. Parker ahead for a first down. 14 yard reception on the play. Zettler to throw, looking slant, and that ball was on the hands of Elder. I'll tell you what, Zettler showed his arm strength there. That was an absolute rocket. The Elder couldn't haul in. Third down and a designed run for Zettler. Zettler's up to the 46 yard line. He'll pick up six yeah, yards on the play. It will be shy of the first down, fourth down to come for the Bengals. You can understand why trailing 14 nothing, you need something to spark this offense. Have to get to the 43. Zettler keeps it. He's got the first down. Zettler picks up five and the first down for Brighton. They'll go with a tailback on first down and not a lot of room for Hall. Third down, delayed blitz coming. That ball batted up by guess who? Fawson with the tip. It falls to the turf. It'll be fourth and 11 here for Brighton. After the punt, Jordan starting at their own eight yard line. Wakely looking to throw, has a man. Ball caught by Bolenbroke as he's ahead for the first down. Wakely again to Bowen broke that ball caught for a pickup of eight. They're going to give him maybe nine on the play. Second down, Wakely going over the middle, and that ball caught. Bowen broke with a nice reception over the middle. A pickup of 27 yards and a first down for Jordan. Little reverse for Bowen broke has Wakely wide open. That ball caught. Some trickeration to Wakely down the sidelines. Touchdown, Jordan. The reverse touchdown throw back to Wakely from 43 yards, 20 to nothing, Jordan. First down for Brighton, starting at their own 20. Screen pass thrown out to Davenport. Davenport got through a couple guys and pushed out of bounds, maybe a little late. Yeah, he was. He had stepped out right around the 33 before Jordan came in. 6.21 left here in our opening half. It's 21 to nothing, Jordan. Brighton in dire need of some offense and some points. Zettler throwing the screen. That ball snagged down. A little, a little high on the throw. Capu did a nice job of reaching back to snag it in. His game limited only three yards. Midway through our second quarter. Second down handoff to Hall. Hall with a big run through the line for Ivona Hall inside the, well, to the 30 yard line. A pickup on the play of 21 yards. Zettler in the shotgun on first down. He's gonna keep this holding. This one's gonna be coming back. I think it was right on the edge. First down and 23 after the holding penalty. Boy, that ball, tight coverage on the play. Right there was Wyatt Jones, and he makes a great break on the ball to break it up before it could get to Sam Huff, incomplete. Third down. Going deep, and that ball... Incomplete. Davenport had come inside and it ended up going out. Some miscommunication there and it'll bring up a fourth down. After the punt, first down for Jordan. Starting at their own nine yard line. Wakely throwing boundary. That ball caught and out of bounds. Nice reception by Ben Lisk. Wakely, hands off. Nice cut inside by Shaver. He's got the first down as he's across the 25 up to the 28 yard line. A pickup of eight on the carry for Jake Shaver. Underneath, what a hit. Nice play made by Devin Elders. That ball was caught by Hughes. Second down for Jordan. 240 left in the half. Shaver out of the backfield. Shaver with some jets as he's up to the 44 yard line. And a first down for Jordan again. Shaver motions out. Wakely evades one man, has a man wide open. It's Bolenbroke, and that ball is in and out of the hands 
tell you what, give credit on the play to Capu Fafita because Bolenbroek was behind everyone and Fafita comes back and the contact breaks it up. Wakely, pressure coming, gets it to Bolenbroek on the slant. First down after Bolenbroek makes a couple guys miss. Still up the field and inside the 35. Inside of two minutes left, Jordan down to the Brighton 34 yard line. Bowen broke across in motion. Wakely fakes out that way. Screen set up for Shaver. Shaver bounces off of one guy, still taking contact, and Shaver ahead to pick up five, maybe six yards on the reception. 121. Left here in the first half, third down. Crew to Shaver in the flat. First down for Jordan as he's dragging the Bengal inside the 20 to the 19 yard line. Jordan inside the red zone now at the 19 with 114 left in our first half. Crew rolling to his right, has a man underneath. That ball caught inside the 15 and pulled out of bounds at the nine yard line on the reception. For Jordan was Noah Hennings, the senior tight end. Shaver motions out. Wakely wide open in the end zone. Touchdown Jordan. Noah Hennings, no one picks up the tight end. He's able to streak in, and it is 27 to nothing. 52 seconds left here in the first half, 28 nothing. And that ball right through the paws of Davenport. On second down, Zettler gonna keep this, has some space. Zettler trying to get outside. He'll dive for the boundary to get out of bounds. He will do so. Picking up 11 yards and a first down for Brighton with 42 seconds left. 36 seconds left. Zettler pressure and the pocket breaks down. Zettler goes down. Boy, tough to tell who to give the sack to. There were two digs there, including Steve Street as well as Ryan Maurer. This ball handed off, Parker to the line and nothing else. Fourth down and a timeout taken by the Diggs with 20 seconds left. Boy, a real good punt. Bolenbroke off the hop, has the boundary. Bolenbroke up to the 43. Now he's gonna try to turn the field a little bit. Here's Bolingbroke with some space on the return. Bolingbroke with a couple of blocks, a good, nice return by Bolingbroke down to the Brighton 40 as a late penalty flag comes in here. But with that, the half has expired. 28 to nothing, the Bengals trailing at home to the Beat Diggers. Wakely going down the sideline, that ball caught. What a catch made by Hughes, a pickup of 26 yards as he got a foot down and out of bounds. Wakely keeps it on first down, spinning around. Wakely has some blocks. Wakely inside the 40, slips through an arm tackle and out of bounds at the 36 yard line. First down. Wakely throws quickly. This ball outside caught. Nice move made after the reception. A couple of them stepping through defenders is Wayne Cobberly, the senior, as he picks up a first down. First down. Fake sweep. Thrown back on a screen play. Blocking, blocking set up, and a touchdown for Jordan. Noah Hennings with his second touchdown reception of the night with 11-10 left here in the third. Brighton will start at their own 20-yard line. Zettler to throw. That ball caught. No, incomplete. They say the receiver didn't make the catch. He was looking for Kefu, the tight end. Another one that hits the receiver and couldn't be brought in. Third and eight for Zettler. He's going to try to keep this one. Zettler weaving through diggers, and it's a first down for Alex Zettler. And on a night where offense has been tough to come by, how about Alex Zettler picking up 11 yards on a really nice run, evading digs. Second down run here for Zettler. Again, able to get through a couple of hand arm tackles. 
by the digs as he has the first down, Zettler does. Zettler throwing the screen, Davenport makes the reception and tackled before it could get down the field. A good play and maybe a touchdown saving tackle made there by Wyatt Jones, just able to trip up Davenport. Might have slowed him up just a bit and allowed Jones to make that play. A toss on second down. Hall stood up after picking up a yard, maybe two. Third and four coming up for the Bengals. 7-15 left in the third. Zettler bottled up. And give a lot of credit to that Jordan defensive front. They made it tough on the line to get any sort of penetration. And the hole just disappeared. Not a lot of room for Zettler there. Zettler going to keep it on fourth down, trying to get around the edge. Zettler stretches forward, and a nice first down picked up by Alex Zettler on the quarterback carry. First down, the fake screen. Zettler going deep, has a man, and that ball's intercepted. Picked off on the play by Wyatt Jones, and the first turnover of the night for Brighton. After the interception, Jordan starts at their own 25-yard line. Wakely keeps it, has the pitch. That's where he goes to Bolingbroke, and Bolingbroke down the sideline, picking up about six yards on the carry. Second down, Wakely keeps it, has blocking set up. Wakely bounced off his own man, through the arms of Salua Messina, across the 50. Wakely with a huge run, still on his feet, and finally pushed out of bounds, evading like six tackles on the play. Wakely down to the 36-yard line of Brighton. First down, up the middle. Salua Messina trying to bring Shaver down. He'll do so, but Shaver able to pick up three, maybe four yards on the carry first. They're opening drive in that first quarter, but boy, in the second, they've really picked things up and gone for the jugular. Second down carry here on the play for Shaver, cuts inside, and Shaver down to the 20-yard line, picking up 13 yards on the carry. First down, Wakely keeps it, able to get around one. Nice stutter step by Crew. Wakely lowering the shoulder, and Wakely Takes it all the way down to the five yard line, does Crew Wakely first and goal for Jordan. Shaver with the carry. Is he in? He is really close. Signal is a touchdown. Touchdown, Beat Diggers. Shaver from five yards out. First down for Brighton. Starting at their own 24 yard line. This ball up the middle with Hall. He's ahead for a pickup of two, maybe three. Second down. Again, a carry up the middle. It's Hall with a big run across the 50, a gain of 24 yards for Brighton. On the carry by Hall. First down, boy, he's got Davenport deep. Dialing one up, Trey Davenport caught. Touchdown, Brighton. Settler to Davenport from 49 yards out, and the Bengals are on the board with 117 left in the third. First down for Jordan, starting on their own 20-yard line. It's Shaver up the middle, bounces off a man. Shaver dragging the pile ahead. First down for Jordan as Shaver picks up 13 yards. The new quarterback, Bruder, hands off on first down. Here's Shaver. Again, trying to get to the perimeter. A nice run by Shaver up to the 50. So Crew Wakely, his night complete. And what a night it was for him. On first down, a carry here on the ground by Shaver. As he picks up five yards. And with that, the third quarter comes to a close. Jordan out in front, 42 to seven, as we head to our fourth and final quarter. Jordan out in front, Crew Wakely's night is complete. Christian Bruderer, the junior, in at quarterback. Throws this ball outside. A nice catch made by Peyton Yak, the sophomore receiver for Jordan. Ball 16, Peyton Yak. 
On second down, again, they give us to number 43. As he runs into the pile, picking up three yards. Third and six for Jordan. To the ground, 43 bursts through to the 30, maybe the 29. He's going to be short of the sticks. It'll bring up a fourth down for Jordan. I would imagine the Diggs would likely go for it. Offense on the field for Jordan on fourth and one. Brighton showing pressure. They go to 43 and nowhere to go. The Brighton defense makes a big stand. First down, Zettler. Play action. Looking for Davenport, and he was going on the post route. Davenport had called it off and was going to the boundary. Thought the coverage was there and miscommunication again between the pair. Second down, Zettler. Called run. Boy, good blocking up front for Alex Zettler. Zettler with a big run. Zettler inside the 30, one man to beat. 10-5, touchdown Brighton, Alex Zettler with a 69-yard touchdown run for Brighton. After the touchback on the kick, Jordan starts out at their own 20-yard line. Give up the middle with Shaver. Shaver, another nice carry as he's ahead for a pickup of 15. Play clock down to five, Jordan. Bruderer will keep it himself, and it's a big hole for Bruderer. How about Bruderer across the 50 and pushed out of bounds at the 40-yard line, and a nice carry for the backup quarterback for Jordan. Sticking with the ground game, Shaver to the 35-yard line before being stood up, gain of four on the carry. Low snap, Bruderer able to snag it. Spins and Bruderer ahead for a first down, picking up nine yards. Here's Shaver again. Shaver trying to turn back inside. He'll get inside of the 25 to the 21, picking up five yards. Bruderer taking his time. He'll hand off to Shaver. Shaver, how about some shifty moves from Shaver? Inside the five. Is he in? Touchdown, Jordan. Jake Shaver, a 21-yard shifty run, and it's 48-14, Jordan. This kick filled it at the six. Boy, nice step around. Good return for Brighton as it's up near midfield. A 44-yard return for the Bengals as the offense comes out right at midfield. 4.55 left here in the fourth. New quarterback on for the Bengals as they go to the ground here. Here is Hall spinning off a tackler to the 45-yard line. Pistol formation for Clifford here on second down. They'll hand off with Hall. Hall wrapped up. He is going to have the first down as he takes this inside the 41-yard line. First and 10, Clifford looking to throw, has Davenport, that ball caught. Davenport, boy, how about that? Great tackle made on the play by Latigo Liuzzi. Clifford on second down, back to the ground with Hall. Hall to the 30 yard line, think he'll have the first down for Brighton. First down, Brighton. Clifford going to run this himself, looking for somewhere to go, and he's not going to get out of the backfield. Play action. Clifford running out of time, trying to get back to the line. He's going to be close. Whether he got they're going to say he did. Third and 12. Pressure on Clifford, going deep, has a man, and that ball caught. What a catch made by Sam Huff for Brighton with 123 left. It's a 32-yard touchdown strike from Clifford. The touchdown for Brighton makes it 49 to 20. Clifford to Huff. There it will be. In a game that even the coaching staffs acknowledged might be for a chance to make the playoffs. It's the first game of the year, but both sides recognized 
a lot riding on this game tonight, and it is the Jordan Beat Diggers who send notice to 5A and a Region 7. The Beat Diggers, every bit deserving of that top five ranking in Deseret News Rewind top five, they defeat the Brighton Bengals 49 to 21. And in a game, as we mentioned, so much riding on it for Jordan, so many guys we could talk about. Crew Wakely with his four total touchdowns tonight was solid. The defense as well. We mentioned guys like Street tonight as well as Isaiah Fawson. The defense stood up, made big plays early on for the Jordan Beat Diggers, but it was Crew Wakely's night. Four touchdowns for Crew in the 49-21 victory over the Brighton Bengals. I want to thank you for joining us on this edition of Deseret News Rewind presented by Intermountain Tosh. For Bill Francis, my name is Dane Stewart. Again, the final score here from Brighton High School. The Jordan Beat Diggers defeat Brighton 49 to 21 to improve to 1 and 0 in region play. What a start for Jordan. We look forward to seeing you with us next time here on Deseret News Rewind. Thank you for joining us, everyone. Have a good night.